in the Twilight series, and now she's starring in the Woody Allen film, Cafe Society. Please welcome the incredibly talented Kristen Stewart. <laughs> treacherous for some reason. You it's made it, shoes. You made it safely. You know yeah. what? You are so cool, though. Like, even your walk-in, that was cool. Like, you high-fived. You didn't miss a single hand. When I high-five, there's like a 97% chance I'm going to miss. <laughs> no, yeah. I was nervous about that, trust really? me. Yeah. <laughs> I was definitely thinking that. I think it would have been uh, much more efficient to maybe just keep my hand out. Like that. Yeah. yeah, and then I was like... But there was a personal connection. <laughs> yeah, exactly. A hand for you. Hello. A hand for you. <laughs> yeah, that was cool. Mm -hmm. I didn't realize that both of your parents were in the entertainment business. Oh, really? Yeah, we've never talked about that. That's I, crazy. I mean, I feel like I, I don't think I knew that. Yeah. So your dad was a stage manager. Yeah. And your mom was a script supervisor. Yeah. Wow. So, you know, the script supervisor, when I worked uh, on, on a TV show, it was like the bane of my existence because I could never remember my lines. <laughs> and the script supervisor would say, you know, you screwed up that last line. I'd be like, I know. Right. And she'd say, it said this way. I go, I know if I could remember it, I wouldn't have screwed it up. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so your mom has like the toughest job, don't you think? Totally. I mean, it's you're like sort of the keeper of the Bible. You're sort of, um, yeah, everyone's go-to. So when you went into show business, did she say to you, learn your lines? Um, yeah, sure. Yeah. Um, I think it was more like, like uh, I'm really, really terrible with continuity. I never, ever think about it. I'm yeah. always like drinking this hand. Um, uh, like, yeah, super impulsive and really annoying to technicians, probably. <laughs> um, so, yeah, she I've never worked with her, but I'm, I'm sure that she would probably annoy me, too. I'd be like, Mom, it's not about that. <laughs> it's not do, you, like, do you feel like you started when you were so young? Do you feel like you were more comfortable on a set because your parents were involved in the business or they were more comfortable letting you get started at such a young age? I think... Conversely, they were uncomfortable. They were like, this is a bad idea, Chris. Like, it's not necessarily something that you're going to love. Like, I wasn't... <clears throat> Um, I wasn't the most uh, um, actory type of kid. I really wanted to be on set. Like I wanted to be a pirate. I wanted to be like a member of the crew. I wanted to have a job. Like they just came home having like clearly they're clearly wearing the hours that they've spent at work and right. like you, you know see it on they, them. Yeah, you know, the yeah. Work. yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and you so, found that appealing. Oh yeah. Yeah, oh, so that's, that's like so why I want to stay. Yeah. And I also uh, heard that you don't really uh, like to read your scripts too much beforehand. It, does that affect your performance? You like to be more spontaneous with your stuff or? Yeah, I, yeah, I just um, don't work a whole lot beforehand unless it's like, um, uh, like shedding of whatever little things that make me sort of distinctly me. But I really want to get to the, like, I, I don't want to hide behind characters and feel like I'm not myself. I want to be like as absolutely visible and sort of like seen as possible. Wow. Um, so in order, I, and so I don't want to like construct anything. I, I love the feeling of being like, how did that happen? And like stumbling on it. And so I don't want to know anything like. But so what happens if you work with a director who wants you to like really d delve deep and get into it and rehearse and rehearse and rehearse? They, then do you have a conflict or you just find common ground somehow? Yeah, nobody's ever made me do that. Oh, well, um, yeah, you must I, be pretty good doing it your way then, right? Yeah. I, mean, I mean, otherwise... Yeah, rehearsal doesn't always mean, like, um, running lines. Yeah. Rehearsal is just, like, getting on the same page and, like, figuring out why you've all been drawn to this thing and, like, meditating on a subject. Yeah. I'm like, ugh. <laughs> um, but, yeah. But I love that you keep that spontaneity in your performance because it feels so fresh and you're discovering, we're discovering yeah, all these moments he's with you. Yeah, Cafe Society, you. yes. Um, yeah, it's amazing. we got to talk about that. Yeah. we got to come back. Mm. Um, but when we come back, uh, we'll find out what it's like taking direction and working with Woody Allen.